Okay, so we'll go here. There's a lot of things wrong here. So I want prescription sunglasses. End goal, prescription sunglasses. I see up here, prescription. I'm going to click on prescription, right? Okay, cool. I can add prescription lenses to send out. Great, that's exactly what I need. So I want to shop prescription sunglasses. All right, so I'll click on that. And now I'll go, okay, I want these. All right. And I'm, you know, okay, I can customize these things. This here, why would I need to, why is this an option? I've clicked on prescription, prescription sunglasses, and now you're showing me non-prescription sunglasses. Um, so that, first off, huge issue. So anyway, I figured it out. I caught my error before I submitted my um, order. So I found that. Okay, great. Now I clicked prescription, right? It says prescription. And I want single vision and I, you know, customize it, right? Um, I went through and I made my, whatever my changes, I could whatever, choose whatever lenses I want to polarize. Let's just do something like this, right? Um, all right, cool. Um, now, wh all of a sudden this changed down to 209 before it was at 400. Oh, and this is annoying. Okay, um, all right, let's, let's just leave that. Am I back to my prescription? Okay, yeah, see here, 415. All right, frame lenses, okay. Let's try a different way. All right, so I want these. All right, well, let's see. Okay, I'm, again, okay, prescription version. Okay. Don't make it harder for your users to give you more money, okay? Just pro tip there. Um, now, okay, so customizing it apparently is not something you can do. Whatever. So... Let's see what is available. Okay, well, this is kind of cool. I want these anyway. And that's it. Perfect. Great. There it is. Prescription. Wonderful. That It's fine. Uh, frame lenses. Great. Add to the bag. Um, now, where do I go to put my prescription after checkout like why isn't it just not in the process like here okay great my next thing is put my prescription in great then I can put my billing information in and then buy that why why have another step that's really, really confusing and unnecessary for an e-commerce website of your, uh, of this purpose. There's no reason why this needs to be something that has to be, uh, to like follow up on an email or add some extra steps. Put it in your cart, put it in the cart process. All right, I get my order, cool, and, and never get the, there's no instructions on submitting my um, prescription, so I just responded to this email, right? Um, and then I also decided, because I don't trust email, so I found their website, and I, okay, great, I send an email through the website, um, and then, um, yeah, okay, this one, but here, there was, this is, 
Uh, thank you for reaching out. I apologize. After reviewing, it's a remixed order, not a prescription order. Uh, no. They are prescription glasses. See, okay. Here we go. This is what I paid. $500. Five hundred and five dollars and thirty-five cents. Right, right. Cool. So I verified. These are non-prescription glasses. They are one hundred and sixty-four dollars. Right, something. Like that, right. Uh, that. No, 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 no. I am not gonna pay five hundred dollars and get these. A hundred. No. I to verify. I went through and I put these prescription new prescription glasses in a cart right that is the I mean it's ten dollars less than this but that is what I paid for and so now you're telling me that I'm going to get these when I paid these for these and also I can't wear these there is a reason why I ordered prescription sunglasses because you know what I need to wear prescription sunglasses I have glasses um, so what the fuck this is not okay